Uh, Randy Bold asks, how to avoid cramping when swimming? And I'm Randy, I'm gonna say take this a step further and post on there where the cramps actually are, because I think that matters with this question. Uh, she takes base salt, Powerade, Ultra, coffee, and has a really good nutrition plan. She only cramps in the swim. Um, man, I'm gonna like, I'm gonna say probably like drop the Powerade Ultra. That like I don't know what's in that, but it, like I think you can do a little bit better as far as a a, a drink um, to go. Like especially if it's a if it if we're talking about a stomach cramp, like it's probably the Powerade Ultra. Um, if it's more of a muscle cramp, um, well, let's go back to Claudia's question with like improving the uh, the capacity of this athlete in the swim, like you know, building up the volume slowly, building up the intensity slowly, um, so that uh, so that we limit the cramping. Um, and if it's in the calves, then there's, you know, from pointing your toes while you're kicking, then there's some more exercises on dry land that we can do to like try to, even while you're sitting at your desk, just kind of sit there and point your toes for a while and um, do a little flutter kick under the desk um, might help. And Randy just texted me and said calves, which is exactly why calves. I suspected that's pretty common in the swim. And I, I'm right there with you. It's just that that whole toe pointing, you know, mm -hmm. function thing that, uh, that you start providing resistance against it. And the, and the muscles are like, mm, I don't think yeah. we're doing this today. I, I think we're gonna get out. And then the, like the biggest thing is just, just relaxing. Um, you know, I'm, uh, I'm married to a swimmer. And so, you know, she does not kick that much. And I'll tell you, like, you, you, you can kick more and get a lot of speed out of it or you can kick efficiently and just not worry about like having those muscles tense up. 